All right, today we want to take a look at the Elba Hypertech W780. Uh, this is one of the great examples of the golden era of the diverse watch uh, produced by Seiko Elba. All right, uh, found this on the Japan uh, auction site, um, came along with the tag, okay, W780. And in fact, I have um, two units of this. They are highly sought after and um, two separate um, color on the face plate one is black and one is blue and one with the gold um, uh, screw and one with the silver screw on top okay and um, one with the uh, factory um, band and the other with uh, Casio band that I've already uh, replaced Okay, let's take a look at the, the band overall. The band overall is uh, rather hardy and um, pretty solid, I must say. Okay, and uh, if you look at the back case, uh, it says here water resistance 10 bar, uh, stainless steel and battle mace, uh, mat base metal and plastic. Okay, um, W780. Okay, if I'm not mistaken, that's uh, 5400 uh, zero zero. Japan says, all right. So um, it has a similar the EL light uh, on the display. And it has the dual uh, twin sensor, barometer, and as well thermometer mm -hmm. sensor. All right, um, here you are. You have the automator. Okay, and the recall and the alarm okay and the time the date the sensor or what I call it the thermometer display and as well the uh, altimeter display okay pretty cool watch um, I would say that not really a diverse watch though okay though it uh, it's pretty um, chunky it'll be on your hand okay it's kind of a pretty huge for its size I think it's more than uh, 55 uh, 58 mm across okay over this side is about 40 plus um, mm all right so overall it's quite a solid watch okay uh, by the way this is um, Lee uh, from less trouble time I oftentimes have uh, watches that I got from overseas and and I sell them on Facebook Live. Uh, you can find me on uh, Less Trouble Time, L E S T R O U B L E T I M E. Less Trouble Time. All right. So thank you very much. And this is just a my one of my first uh, brief review on uh, Japanese uh, watches. Thank you.